down, down. No. No, okay. no, like, no. <laughs> our older brother, bro. <laughs> so, <laughs> today, today we're going to speak about inter, interracial marriage and inter, 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 you, what the fuck? Interracial, interracial relationships. relationships and our thoughts on it. So, anybody wants to start? And we're talking about people who are on opposite, opposite spectrum. We're not talking about like Latin with Latin. We're talking about opposite spectrum. Like Chino con Latino. Chinese. Portuguese, Japanese, 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 European, Japanese, 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 different, Japanese, different Japanese, cultures Japanese. completely. Um, who wants to start this one off? I, mean, I think I can start this one off. I mean, to be honest with you, um, in my opinion. No, I first think, of all, this is how we're going to start. How, um, from where have you been all your girlfriends or anybody that you messed with before? Okay. From what country? I've dated, I mean, I don't want to say black because it's not a country, but um, U.S., American, American, African American. 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 I've had a Mexican. I've had a Dominican. I've had a Colombian, Puerto Rican, of course. Everybody knows the mother of my kids. Um, Comment the leader. It's okay. It's okay. <laughs> go ahead. 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 Go Portuguese people and Brazilian people are at. Um, and it's, I've, I've mainly kept it more between ER and PR, but I've been, I've been open to other options. Um, I've only been in... Not talking about Asia, but anybody that you mess with. Oh! I've been, I've, like, I've been around a little bit. Around um, little bit. Uh, let's see. Um, DR, mm-hmm. PR. I went to, I went to, I went to, I went to, I, went to, I, I was, I was in, Hon- in Hungary. Hungarian? This is the call? Yeah. Gary? My nigga, oh, you pulled uh, out a list. <laughs> yeah, you brought out a list. Uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Why Canadian, uh, French and Mexican, uh, Samaria, Dominican, uh, Puerto Rican, uh, uh, Latin, 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 Latin. Colombia, Mexican, uh, Colombia. I was in the Philippines, Moroccan, Brazil. Cuba. The next. <laughs> <laughs> next person. Please. <laughs> <laughs> um, mainly Spanish girls. Oh, yeah. Spanish girls. Just in general. I love that. I've been Spanish girls and like two white girls. That's it. Wait, so you've had an African American? Yes. Okay, I thought I was the only one. I was gonna say, wait, somewhere down the line, she's there. Where did I fuck them? Oh shit! I'm joking. Yo, if you're African American, unfollow this dumbass. This thing is racist as fuck. This thing is racist as fuck. Unfollow. I was joking, but okay. Allegedly. Allegedly. So, can you date someone at the opposite? And we're talking about dating now. We're not talking about just hooking up. We're talking about dating. Can you date someone from the opposite spectrum? And do you think you could be happy? Yeah, I mean, listen, it's. People find happiness in different ways. Okay. Explain. Um, okay. For someone, for example, for someone that loves Chinese food, what is what oh, the no. Chinese food culture is. Hold on a second. Hear oh, me out. Stereotypical United States. Chinese yeah, food. no, yeah. not that Chinese food. I'm talking about the actual Ch- um, Chinese, Japanese. Okay. That culture kind of Asian. food. Asian. You'll find someone that's Asian that will cook you what you like. And you can find happiness and love through that. Or am I wrong? You're wrong. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey. Yo, I, I use it as an example. Okay. Well, they they get into a relationship because of their interest in their cultures. Okay. And then, oh, sorry. Then speaking English, my bad. Bro. You get a Japanese girl, right? Now she wants to learn Spanish, right? Okay. But you want to learn Japanese. Just keep it simple. And you just chilling there. Oh, you learning Japanese? She's learning Spanish. She learned Spanish. You learn Japanese. Whoa, whoa, whoa. And you guys talking. Musun, I got no Yeah, yeah, you know. Hello, how you doing? Como tu estás? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Flow. Se enamora. I just said she wants to learn the Dominican culture. Please, so let's go to DR. Live for a couple years. You learn the Dominican culture. How people live over there. Lo flow. Whoa, whoa, whoa. And then you go to Japan. Learn that. Or you go to India, whatever. Yeah, see, like that people could um, 
fall in love and live together. Because now they understand where you're coming from and all that crazy shit. You know what I mean? But it will take time to get used to the other, pe- the other person. Because your family is not going to know Japanese. Their, their family is not going to know Dominican Spanish. You know what I mean? So you think that that's the only way or this is just a way? A way. A way to get into that. Or it's, uh, another way is just because she's just physically attracted. And then you guys get emotionally involved. And that's it. Okay. Like regular relationships. Jason. Um, I think I would date outside of my race. Um, I just got to vibe with the person. And it's like, it'll be normal. If it's a Spanish girl, and we vibe, then we vibe. If you're white, black, it doesn't matter. I just think it has to, today, it has to be a connection there. That's if what, there's a connection there, then okay. why yeah, not? But that's what I was Maybe I'm just the only ignorant one here. I mean, I'm going to put myself there. I don't think I could. Like, listen to me. If I'm going to date a Russian girl, she needs to kill it in bachata. Have to. Have to. If you can't dance bachata with me, trust and believe, I am not falling in love with you. So you don't care about the salsa of the No, 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 no. <laughs> you, could, you could also throw that into play, like, you know what I mean? But bachata, you need to be natural. You have to do that new flow normal que yo tengo que forzar. Have to. English. Have to. Because the thing is, like, I'm a, I'm a believer, uh, you know, you know, I've heard about the, Oedip- I think it's the Oedipus Complex. That you look for, you look, you, you always look for somebody who reminds you of your mom. Okay. Yeah. Right? So, I'm a, I'm a believer that I think that I need to find someone who can understand, like, the relationship that me and my mom have. And I don't feel like somebody outside of our culture, outside of our spectrum, can really understand that type of relationship. And there's certain things that I feel like are needs. And one of them, I need to be able to dance for time. I need to, like, alahrate, like, you know, just sing to your ear. Like, and you understand what I'm saying? Like, you know what I'm trying to say? Again. <laughs> And, and, and maybe I'm just that maybe I'm just that ignorant, maybe. But again, then again, it, goes, it goes to what where I was saying. Like they want to learn about who you are. It, it's it, like I'm saying, I'm talking about. But you don't go to go to some of the chino. But that's what I do, mama. I'm talking about somebody that, that's interested. Like, okay. Like you teaching me, like it starts like you teaching me, and I'm teaching you type shit, and then you just evolve into something bigger. So you got you got what I'm saying. I about? no, I understand what you are, what, you, what all of you are saying, but I just feel like there has to be like. This essence of this, like this. So, if this, there's a white girl that knows how to dance bachata, it's all good. You're there. She's a, she's in a much better position if she was white girl than that bachata. I can say that much. <laughs> I'm serious. Okay. All your white girls out there. I'm okay. 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 Yo, okay. listen. Yo, we gotta say bachata this is crucial. We gotta you. say that in hey, English. Right. Hey, I'm wait. We, we gotta say I'm this in English. English. Attention, white girls. If you want to dance or not dance, if you want to go out. Well, El Negro, El Oscuro, you got to learn how to dance. You have to. Bachata, have to. Okay? Have to. Have to. It's, it's just man. I feel like it's man. For me, I feel like that's that, that's a deal breaker. Like, I've danced with, like, hot girls, and they've danced like a mess, and I'm like, yo, I'm not even wasting my time. Like, yeah. I feel like it's okay. just, you have to, you know? I feel like, and there's certain, like, cultural things that I feel like, I can't name them all off the top of my head, but I just feel like there's certain cultural things that they have to happen. You have to know how to cook me. I don't go on my Okay. Have to. Okay. Have to. If you don't know how to cook me a hot dog on But this is just talking about dating, like not even like a but, girl, like but, marriage. None but of that. But my thing is like, yo, but yeah, when you date, you know, like we had, we spoke before. If you date, you know, it's more like seeing if this could go somewhere. Like you know what I mean? And if you don't have these qualities, okay. trust and believe, this, this is not gonna go anywhere. Okay. Like, the I, conversation will never go into okay. Yeah, yeah, no, because listen, it's too loco. So if you want to go to a discoteca, buy a bachata ticket, that you don't know how to play, and I have to be dancing with another tiger and he's singing to another tiger. No. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. Okay. It just doesn't work. That's fair. Um. So, it's safe to say. I mean, if you had the opportunity, you would be open. Maybe you'll be open. But we know your answer. Nah. Um. And I, you know, okay, I'll be open as well. It's just like you know. So it depends at the end of the day. No. If you find an Asian girl and a mako sina sushi, you good. And if I'm into sushi, I'll eat sushi. I'm talking about like right now. No. <laughs> okay. Because so now, I'm, I'm my sure. question is now talking about interracial, like you know, dating, like. How, how do you, you feel? feel? Exactly. So how, yeah, how, 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 do, how do you parents like now deal with this? Like, do you think? How do you, yeah. How, do you think? Well, uh, do I, you think your mom will be okay? My mom, be fine. My mom will go fuck. Mama, mama, mommy don't mama, care. Mom, mom will be fine. Like you know what I mean? I mean, I don't would, be, I don't but I'll tell you this much. No, no, I, but I'll tell you this much. She would definitely make her learn how to talk in Spanish like we do. No, no. But okay. That would be fine. Me, mm-hmm. me going based on you. Know, I, I've met your mom. Wonderful lady. She's very outspoken. 
She would I feel be, like I feel like your mom would call her out. Yes, yeah. no, 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 not call her out. I'm trying to be like I'm trying to be you know be a little more blunt, which is like all oh, the nigga, what the fuck did you bring home type of shit. You no. you be surprised. I feel my like that's mom, the one thing my mom she, has zero she, comments she on. Say that. No. I mean, I don't, I don't bring a lot of girls home. I've only brought one. I'm gonna keep it Jewish, and my mom will be like, "Hey, I didn't know. Don't do that with the people. Where'd you find her?" My mom will be like, that. "What do you think? Would you agree to this?" Huh? Your mom would say something like that. Yeah, but then that goes to back to what you're saying. Like, the girls that I'm attracted to are silly, are down to earth. That's how my mom is. And so, like, if I'm bringing somebody home that's exactly like her, I don't think she'll care what race she is. My mom would. I mean, I, they're I, not gonna I, be able to communicate. I, I you don't mean, like, but let's, let's, let's I don't think she's not. Be a little real here. We do have a little brother that likes everything in the universe. Okay, and, and what does he bring home though? Exactly. Right. He's brought, so, no, right. he's brought home trash. Let's be honest. All of them. Exactly. <laughs> he's so, brought home trash. But you know, I've heard my mom make a few comments. Yo, like my nigga, like, what you what you brought this fucking red head, fucking dark skinned. I mean, listen. That's racist. <laughs> that yeah, is racist. Yeah. Look what he's bringing home. No, of course. I mean, I would if never she would, bring I'm pretty sure, I'm 100% like sure that. if she walks into your house and she talks to your mom, oh, hey, how you doing? And she's educated, she could be as dark as charcoal and she will not have a comment. The problem is that your brother brings girls and they're just in his room a smashing Make That's hell literally noise. what it is. Your mom trying to sleep, and then she's like, D man D with this old school ass bitch. Like, what the fuck yeah, is going even, on? And even if you she's like, I mean? white as a, a, a paper, nigga, my mom would find some shit. She'll be like, yeah, you know what I mean? Well, I mean, this is my but thing. But this is my thing. This is my thing. Your moms, though. You but this is my thing. Like, I feel like you need, like, you can't. You can't bring every hoe home. Like you just, can't. especially if you live in your parents. No, yeah. but it's my thing. Especially if you live in your parents' house, you can't bring every hoe home. You just can't. Like you know what I mean? I'm gonna be honest with you. There's a, a lot of girls that I fuck that I wouldn't take home, ever. Not even like, not even around my mom's block. Like you know what I mean? <laughs> exactly, type. Like you know what I mean? Like you only. I feel like you only bring home somebody who you see something with. If not, you don't bring them home. That's that's me. You know what I mean? My little brother, he that nigga probably brought in like more girls to the house than girlfriends that I've had. True. You know what I mean? But I, I, I just wouldn't be able to do that. Like you know what I mean? Look, one girl slipped and met my mom. <laughs> slipped and met my mom because she was hanging out downstairs in front of my building. That's the only way she got to meet my mom. And it wasn't like I was like, oh mommy, here you go. I was like, oh no no, I see see mommy, we're And that's it. I had three girlfriends and my mom met all three of them, but they were like my girlfriends. For a while. My mom has met one girl that I've introduced her to. One. Three. And that's it. Even though I still hear hear about it to this day. Oh, you pull on me back all the time. Yeah, mom. I mean, so, I mean, my mom's met all my little brothers. <coughs> you know, trash. See, I don't think she's met them. She's seen them. <laughs> she's, she's seen them. Well, my nigga, listen. Yeah, they, they run up they, and down the stairs and stealing shit. No, and on top of that, I mean, there's a few that's actually slipped into the living room waiting for him, and she's been like, and you are? Like, exactly. Wow. <laughs> yeah. Wow. Um, in my, I, I want to say maybe two. That's it. I know. Yeah. Well, <laughs> man, got that problem. Got a bunch Interesting of relationship. <laughs> it could work. Yeah. I, don't, I, don't, uh, <laughs> I think they're very It's coming from the nigga that's been that was in a relationship from sophomore freshman year. High school. Exactly my point. You guys are a bunch of hoes. <laughs> <Okay. laughs> you get that. You're going out. Hey! Hey! <laughs> 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 <